Gustavo San Lucas and welcome to Viviana Sport Fishing. Today is March 14th, 2020. Um, before we get on with the fishing report, uh, let's just talk a little about oh, things that are happening around the world. Um, I know in the US and a lot of other countries right now, people are a little scared um, and they should be. Here in Cabo, you know, it's very calm. Uh, things are actually very normal. Um, nothing is closed. Vents are still going on. It's just a regular day without tourism. <laughs> you know, um, I know no flights, you know, have been, all flights have been, a lot of flights have been canceled. People are just not being able to leave their homes or don't want to leave their homes and get on an airplane and come to Cabo. And that's okay. Um, we totally understand, you know, we lived through the swine flu and we lived through a hurricane ordeal. Um, so we can live through this too. Um, I'm just hoping that once this all blows over, everybody's healthy and uh, you guys will still get on a plane, find, that, find those funds to get on the plane and come down and visit us in Cabo. You know, hopefully this can, you know, all be over within a month, month and a half and uh, things can get back to normal because uh, down here, you guys know, Cabo is 100% tourism. So no boats going out, no people in restaurants, no hotels, you know, no nothing. And uh, it can only go on for so long. So we'll have to see who's still kicking when all of the uh, dust blows over. So. That's kind of it, I guess. I hope everybody, you know, like I said, stay safe and uh, hopefully we'll see you down here soon. Um, weather has been fabulous. It's been, you know, low 80s or so in the day and uh, low 70s at night. So it's been beautiful and uh, fishing hasn't been too shabby. You know, we still got a lot of striped marlin out there, um, some good yellowtail out there. And we've still had tuna off and on. So we had a couple good days with tuna this week. And uh, things, you know, are, are, are absolutely fabulous out there. Still lots and lots of whales. So for all of you that are down here in Cabo, you know, there you can still get on the boat and go fishing. You know, uh, a lot, actually some red snapper. Victor on my uh, small boat over the past couple days has had some beautiful red snapper. So, uh, I hope to see you guys all da back down here in Cabo. Um, it's a pretty sad situation when there's no tourists down here, but uh, we'll all get through this and uh, hopefully we'll see you guys down here again. Stay tuned for the few pictures we have, few videos we have, and uh, hopefully we'll see you down here in Cabo guys soon. Thanks, bye. Hi guys, I wanna tell you about our whale watching special we're having right now. Um, on our hurricane, we have a special running for whale watching. Whale watching season is in full swing. Um, a lot of whales out there. It's been fabulous for whale watching. We can do two hours on the hurricane, up to six people for $150. That's a uh, private whale watching tour for you and your family. Um, just pick the time of day you want to go and uh, let's go see some whales. It's been awesome out there, guys. So uh, hopefully we'll see you out there whale watching. Thanks. Bye.
I'm ready. There's two down there now. Hey, buddy. It's a big boy. Oh, we got it. Oh, we got it. Oh, got it. Oh, got it. Oh, got it. Let's go. Pay attention to me. He's a hungry boy. Okay, ready. Use your hands. Come on, guys. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey, hi. Oh, my God. You came so close. Oh. This is what I wanted, you guys. Okay. Now put it in your mouth. In my mouth again? Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> 